Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, you are going to learn the new feature introduced in Java 11 that makes it possible to write scripts in Java and execute them directly from the command line. Let's start and follow my steps. Step 1. Make sure to have installed in your machine Java 11 or above. In my case, I have installed OpenJDK 17. Step 2. Create an empty file called hello.java and open it with your favorite editor. In my case, I'm going to open it with Visual Studio Code. Step 3. Declare a simple Java class, hello, put in the main method. Inside the main method, print in the console a message like hello Java 11. Before Java 11, first you had to compile the class with the Java C and then run it with the Java command. From Java 11, you can simply use the Java command, in this case java hello.java, to run the Java class. Java 11 allows executing your Java source code directly using the Java interpreter. The source code is compiled in memory and then executed by the interpreter. The limitation is that all the classes have to be defined in the same file. Step 4. Java 11 allows you to write scripting in Java. Let's do it. In the same folder, create a new file called copy files. Basically, you are going to write a simple script to generate a copy of a file. The name of the file to copy will be the input of the script. This script is a normal Java class with the import and the declaration of the main method. Step 5. Inside the same folder, create a file to copy. Then type java hyphen hyphen source 11 and then copy files and the name of that file. Don't forget to, to use the option hyphen hyphen source specifying java 11. Well done! As you can see, the file .txt iPhone copy, where inside there is the same content. Step 6. There is another way to run the script without specifying the command java iphone iphone source 11. In my case, java is installed inside the path slash user slash bin and then java. Check inside your local machine. Then open the script copy files and at the top of the file add the command slash user slash bin slash java iphone iphone source 11. Good. Now run it without any specific command. You see this error because the script doesn't have the right permission. Use chmod plus x command. Good. Now let's run the script again. Well done. Thank you for watching this video, subscribe to my channel to be always updated about new videos that I will upload and see you in the next one, bye!